closing in on the year 2023, an important 12 months in the history of Indian sports. 2023 Asian Games was a historical multi-sport event for India as for the first time ever, Indian athletes brought home more than 100 medals. One of those incredible medal wins was javelin thrower Kishore Jaina. When we think of javelin, we think of Neera Chopra. And in the age of Neera Chopra's dominance in track and field, not only in India but also throughout the world, it seems unlikely for any other javelin thrower from India to steal the spotlight. But if there's anyone capable of doing that, it's Kishore Jena. Jena landed in Hangzhou as an unknown figure to most Indians, but he returned from China as a new star. Hailing from the village of Kota Sahi near Puri in Odisha, Kishore Kumar Jena is the youngest among seven siblings with six elder sisters born to Keshav Jena, a farmer cultivating paddy. In a bid to provide for his family, Jena decided to pursue a career in sports aiming to secure a position in the Indian Army through the sports quota. Interestingly, javelin throw wasn't his initial choice, it was volleyball. Recognizing his skills as a volleyball player, he found himself at the Odisha government sports hostel in Bhubaneswar, where he was introduced to javelin just a few years ago. When the javelin throw event began in China Hangzhou at the Asian Games, the unthinkable happened. Kishore Jena, with his throw, had left Neeraj Chopra, the golden boy of India, behind. Neeraj was trailing behind Jena. In Kishore's third javelin throw, covering a distance of 86.77 meters, he seized the lead in the javelin final, surpassing Neeraj by 2.28 meters at that point. However, this moment in the spotlight was short-lived as Neeraj swiftly reclaimed the lead in the very next attempt with an impressive throw of 88.88 meters, restoring the expected order. But the throw that ensured him the silver medal did not just happen. Jena had to fight for his attempts. Kishore Jena found himself perplexed as the official raised the red flag, disqualifying the second attempt, despite clear evidence that his front foot was far from the white line. Neera Chopra quickly intervened, encouraging Kishore to challenge the officials and the decision. After a couple of replays, the initial ruling was overturned and Kishore Jena's throw was officially recorded at 79.76 meters. Notably, the replays not only highlighted the noticeable gap between Kishore's foot and the line, but also revealed that the Chinese official had not even looked at Kishore's foot before signalling the disqualification. But it was his fourth throw that changed the course of the competition for Jena. In his fourth attempt, Kishore Jena delivered an even more impressive throw, covering a distance of 87.54 meters. At this point, Jena had a better throw than Neeraj Chopra. And Neeraj had a solid competition for the gold. The throw from Jena marked the second best throw by an Indian in the history of athletics and the sixth best throw by an Asian athlete. And that is the story of how a young boy from simple and humble beginnings made it to the pages of history books of Indian history. Youngest of seven siblings, with the weight of, his, of the world on his shoulders, Jena is a story of perpetual dedication and passion. Kishore Jena says that sports is all he has and he wants to give it his absolute best. And so far, he has stayed true to his promise. Getting a notable fifth place finish at the World Championships giving Olympic champion Neera Chopra a run for his money at the Asian Games, earning the title of India's second best thrower in history, achieving a significant new height and a new personal best, securing a spot at the 2024 Paris Olympics and clinching an Asian Games silver medal. That is it for this video. Stay tuned to Ref Sports for sports coverage like you've never seen before.